problem number five. So before we are working on problem number five, here is the corollary of the mean value theorem, which says that if the derivative of two functions are equal for every x in an open interval, then f minus g is constant there. Okay. So the condition is we need the derivative to be equal on the open interval. On the open interval, then we can conclude f minus g is constant. Okay. Now we have f of x equal one over x, and g of x is given by this piecewise function. First, show that f prime of x equal g prime of x for all x in their domains. So f prime of x clearly minus one over x squared, and g prime of x is equal to minus one over x squared. if x bigger than 0 and the derivative of this is also negative 1 over x squared if x less than 0 so in the domain of g actually in the domain so because f prime of x only makes sense for x not equal to 0 so it means that f prime are equal to g prime so f prime of x is equal to g prime of x on the domain of both of them. Okay, now can we apply this corollary to our problem? because here we have f prime of x equal g prime of x okay let's see so in order to conclude that f minus g is constant it means here constant mean it constant everywhere okay we want to conclude that f minus g is constant everywhere So now let so let the interval a b containing zero. So let a b is an interval containing zero. Then it is not true. on a b so this is not true why it is not true because we only have f prime equal g prime whenever x not equal to 0 so if we have an interval that contains 0 then this statement is not true which means that we cannot apply that corollary Okay, so we cannot conclude, can conclude that f minus g is constant on the interval a, b. Meanwhile, in the problem, we want to conclude that f minus g is constant everywhere. But here, actually, for any open interval containing 0, f minus g is possibly not constant on that interval. Oh, one more thing is that we can manually check that f minus g is not constant because so say on the interval in, so 
Here we cannot conclude that f minus g is constant on a b. But in fact here, f minus g is not constant because f minus g is equal to this minus that, 0, if x greater or equal to 0, and equals to f minus g equals negative 1 if x less than 0. So if in the interval containing 0, say that's a, b, okay, the value of f minus g on the left of the origin is equal to negative 1. Meanwhile, the value of f minus g to the right of the origin is equal to 0. So it is not constant on the open interval AB. So the objective of this problem is to show that this problem does not contradict the corollary. So even though f minus g is not constant, it is not because the mean value theorem is failed, but because the condition doesn't the condition is not met by this.